Hey jamani guys the good news is here Kevin Kangeve Kenya Jui have been arrested guys um wenye mnakumbuka story ya Kevin Kangeve Kenya Jui alikuwa anaishi USA na alikuwa na mpenzi wake alikuwa anaitwa Margaret Bitu na wakiwa pare US yani they have been lovers but kulikuwa na shida hapa na pare that um, Margaret alikuwa anataka kuoreka as in alikuwa anataka huyu jamaa amuoe but jamaa was not ready na vinye sasa Margaret aliona hivyo akaanza kuona mtu mwingine but still walikuwa in in communication with uh, Kevin so uh, Kevin alipanga mpango yake ya kuua Margaret na akajua akaona ile jia rahisi ni amuue na the same same day achukue dege yake arudi nyumbani akuje ajifiche home so aliambia Margaret tafadhali na kuomba unipeleke wapi unipeleke airport na msichana mzuri tu akafanya hivyo akampeleka airport Uh, but hakuwa anajua alikuwa anaenda kuuriwa na venye walifika Rogon Airport e-commerce set uh, in USA uh, uyu jamaa Kevin Kangeve alienda na akaweza kumwangamiza akaweza kumkatakata vibaya sana na akamwacha huko kwa airport alafu akachukua flight yake moja kwa moja mpaka JKI Akarad Kenya guys and the news news zile trade sana US zika trade sana Kenya kwa Kevin Kangeve ameweza kumua Margaret B na akaweza kukimbilia uh, nyumbani mafichoni yani as in Kenya and uh, kutoka hiyo siku Kevin Kangeve akakuwa wanted kutoka last year mwezi wa uh, that was in october ya yeah, akakuwa wanted so akakuwa anatafutwa hapa na pare and in january akashikwa akiwa kwa club frani hapo uh, nairobi na venye alishikwa alipelekwa moja kwa moja mpaka mudhaiga police station na pare mudhaiga police station aliweza you know <laughs> kitu kidogo watu wangu kitu kidogo Uh, kuna semekana kuwa kuna watu wenye walikuwa naenda kumuona pale akiwa si watu wa familia but watu wenye wako kwa in government walikuwa naenda kumuona pale Mudhaiga police station na pia au mapolisi wa Mudhaiga police station waliweza pia kuhusika Kevin Kangeve akaweza kuwa akaweza kutoroka kutoka yani alitoka na akachukua gari akachukua madhri na hivyo ndivyo you know are escape from Mudhaiga police station so guys tena news is ka trade sana Kevin Kangede ametoroka akiwa kwa mikono ya you know akiwa in police custody yani watu wanasema hakuna mtu mwenye alijua alienda wapi you know but the news ni atikuwa alichukua gari matatu na akatoka it was planned na tulisikia kuwa wale mapolisi wote walikuwa in duty on that day waliweza kuachishwa kazi mara moja ya yeah, so um, guys kutoka hapo sasa tena akakuwa wanted na akakuwa tena anatafutwa so guys uh, jana usiku Kevin Kangeve Kenya Jui aliweza kushikwa tena ha li arrested aliweza kushikwa tena na alishikiwa gong alikuwa gong alikuwa ameenda ku kwa relative i think maybe bado alikuwa anatafuta mahali anaweza jificha eh jamani let me tell you guys serikali iko na mkono mrefu eh tunasikia anga at serikali iko na mkono mrefu watu wangu eh eh au watu wanaweza wakakutafuta mpaka wa strike kama we mwenyewe ujui hmm? si mchezo si mchezo So guys for me kitu ya kwanza I'm so happy kuona serikali yetu inafanya kazi at least one familia ya Margaret Bitu imepata justice cause guys acheni niwaambie kama zile mauaji huwa zinafanyika hii Kenya kama watu huwa wanafuatwa vyenye Kevin Kangeve Kenya Joy amefuatwa vyenye Joy Irungu pia yeye amefuatwa you know guys acheni niwaambie Uh, Kenya inaweza kuwa mahali pazuri. Guys na 
e hata nimeangalia ile story ya nani ya Joe na ma, Maribe Jackie Maribe nikaona e eh, ukweli serikali yetu saizi inajaribu kujitahidi cause guys tuliona Jackie Maribe ari you know uh, yani alipatikana yeye hakuwa na hatia but the DPP wamerudisha uh, appeal ya kuanzisha hiyo kesi tena upya cause hawaamini hawaamini like Jackie ametoka hivyo so guys e eh, inaitwa Kenya inaitwa Kenya so for me naomba tu justice ipatikane maybe kama Jackie akuwa na makosa Mungu tu aintervene uh, you know atatoka free but kama alikuwa na makosa hata yeye anafaa afi zero ndio hii Kenya watu wenye wanafikiria nga they have power of other Kenyans wapate you know wapate kuelewa hawana power size tunaona mambo mengi sana like jana niliona watu wawili kuna mwalimu mwenye wadhigio uh, kamelezo kuna madam mwingine alikuwa na red uh, trouser wa wa nini wa um, juja mm? pia yeye alikuwa ameuliwa na huo hata inasemekana ni kama bwanake alikuwa amemuua cuz bwanake alikuwa ana rape mtoto wao uh, amekuwa analala na mtoto wao Saizi inasemekana kuwa yani inawezekana kuwa bwanake ndiye alimfanyia hiyo kitendo. You know so guys, saizi mi naomba tu justice si kwa watu wenye wako famous ama watu wenye wanaonekana wako wako na pesa. Mi na hope justice iko inapatikana kwa kila mtu cuz Kenya yetu mahali imefika. Yani kumeharibika. Kenya yetu mambo imeharibika. Pesa yani pesa ndio inafanya kazi. Imagine kama maybe tuseme uh, familia ya ya Margaret Bitu ni watu wenye hawana pesa. Huu Kevin Kangethe angetoka tu hivyo na hiyo ingeishia tu hapo hivyo. Maybe kama tuseme uh, the US government hawako involved in hii kesi. Kevin Kangethe Kenya juu angetoka tu hivyo, angeenda tu hivyo. Unaona? Na this guy angejua tu akienda hata afanyie mtu mwingine unyama kama huo Ha, hakuna mahali atapelekwa au watu wote walikuwa involved mapolisi na nani na nani wamekuwa tena wakifikiria watu wengine mm. mtu kama DJ Fatso yake ilienda tu hivyo hata hiyo kisi hakuna mtu mwenye alijua venye ilienda ha? wa Kenya wamekesa de, wame, wamelala kama wanakesha day and night for almost two months na hakuna kitu ilifanyikana. So guys, mi kuona justice inaenda ikifanyika hii Kenya yetu. Mi naomba tu kuende hivyo. Ndio at least Kenya ikuwe mahali pazuri, tukue yani tunaishi na furaha bila kuogopa. Yani ukijua tu usalama wako yani upo. So guys, that is it. I'm so happy Kevin Kangethe Kenya Jui have been rearrested and uh, let's hope our Kenya government itafanya kazi yake. Saizi sioni akipotea tete